did a search for bankruptcy Eugene today, and it looks like although Armstrong Bankruptcy Law Offices has a site here uh, that they're paying uh, Google AdWords for, for Eugene bankruptcy, uh, they are no longer showing up on the list of sites. So uh, yesterday they were number two, and today they're nowhere to be found. So this shows how fickle SEO can be. Um, it does appear uh, that I think I saw them not on this list of uh, attorneys here, but uh, on another search that I did, I think it was uh, Eugene, Oregon bankruptcy. If I go on here to the next page, um, this Kent Anderson was showing up prominently. Um, and then here's your site here on the second page. Now, what I've found is they actually, Armstrong Bankruptcy has this page, .net, they have a second, this page that you've shown me, and they also have armstrongbankruptcylawoffices.com. So they don't have a unified strategy. Uh, it appears that somebody they know is knows something about the internet, but probably doesn't know a lot about web strategy. This is not a good way to do things. Uh, you want one site, and that's it. Now this, it looks like I see a DEX thing down here. Maybe this is provided by the, the phone company, and this is part of their package for buying uh, ads in the, new, in the uh, phone book. So here's the one that you're most concerned about, though, because it does get a lot of SEO. Um, it's very good for that. Now, here I am loading it up to the front here. Um, yeah, this actually isn't a very good design, but we can go into that later. Uh, what's important here is that their pages, as you see here, the title, how it works, matches their permalink up here, how it works. They don't have a goofy, I don't, you know, just uh, machine tagging in there. Now, see here this where it says exercise your legal right to a better financial future. That's part of the alt tags and uh, things like that. So those things need to be assigned on your website too because machines like Google can't read what your images are unless you tell them what the pictures are of. So, um, but here you go. So how it works and how it works is down here in the material, which is absolutely critical. And then they talk about it. And there, this area here and this here is probably greater than the 300 words required by SEO rules to show up in things. And as we go down to various things, how, um, why choose us? Um, I don't see that in here. So not all their pages are perfect. Um, I do know that when you search for, uh, Armstrong, let me take a look here that, uh, when that see, okay. So here you go. Armstrong law offices exercise your legal right. So see how this shows up here. And this nice uh, little statement shows up down below and it looks right. And that's because somebody is actually doing some SEO on their end. Now you're now, if you look at yours here, your page just says about, and then here you see there's why choose us, which is the page and their domain title Armstrong. See how that, that whole thing pops up there when I hold the mouse over it, that's actually programming. Somebody did that. So uh, that needs to be done for your site as well. See, we mouse over, all you get is about, about who, about what. So if somebody were to actually find your web page here, it would just say about. And that's not very helpful to anyone that wants to know that you're a, a great uh, bankruptcy attorney. So a uh, very strange strategy here from these guys. And today, like I said, this site is gone. Um, but yesterday it was number two. So it's a fickle, fickle world out there.